learn to solve a two point cross using three easy steps. Let's consider a problem wherein the total number of offsprings of a particular genotype are mentioned. First, we need to find out if the genes are linked or no. If the number of offsprings in the genes vary, like 150, 51, 48, 152, that means all genotypes have different number of offsprings. Thus, we can say that the genes are not linked. Next, we need to identify the parental and the recombinant genotype. The genotypes with the most number of offsprings, that is 150 and 152 offsprings, are the parental type. And the ones with the less number of offsprings, that is the 51 and the 48, are the recombinant offsprings. Last, we must calculate the distance between the two genes using the recombination frequency formula. So here we can see that capital AB and small AB has the highest number of progenies as 150, 152. So they are the parental genotypes and the remaining two genotypes are the recombinant genotypes. We can now find the distance between the genes A and B. The recombination frequency is directly proportional to the gene distance and it is the total number of recombinant offsprings upon the total number of offsprings into 100. So here the recombinant offsprings are 51 and 58 and the total number of offsprings are the total of all the parental and the recombinant offsprings. Upon calculating we get 24.69% or 24.69 centimorgans or MAP unit, which is the distance between genes A and gene B. In some conditions, the number of offsprings for all the genotype is the same. Thus, we can say that the genotypes are not linked, that is no crossover or linkage is possible and the distance between the two genes cannot be determined. If this video was helpful, then please like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave us your valuable comments. Thank you.